Wonderful turnout. This is a big surprise for all of us that so many people have turned out. Thank you so much. It's greatly appreciated, probably more now than it was 50 years ago. And as you know, 50 years ago, we would have filled the street with teenagers. And people, and people, people don't realize, people don't realize why it was so successful and popular. You try and tell a kid today, we had no music on our radios. The BBC played nothing. We had Radio Luxembourg at night, God bless it, but that was covered in static. But we put up with it because it's all we had until that ship went out there. Changed our life. For the first time we had transistor radios. For the first time we heard music on the beach. 24-7 Beatles, Stones, Kinks. It was incredible. And I, as a young 20-year-old who arrived at Harwich and came through this town to go out to that ship, I spent eight weeks there, fell in love with my mate Emperor Roscoe, we'd become lifelong friends, and then I went up to Caroline North and spent a year and a half off the Isle of Man before leaving for Radio Luxembourg and 16 years of a career on 208. So my career began here, and I'm emotional about it, and I could cry thinking about it, because it was such a special time for all of us. <laughs> Thank you, Mike. I think, I think I've expressed what I wanted to express, but I want to say this is just incredible that, you know, we will leave this planet, but we will leave something behind. Thank you very much. Thank you, buddy. I gave you the wrong one, mate. I'm sorry, that was from the loop. Hang on. Where the action is.